Hello everyone, this is Dante Collect here with another action figure review. And here we have the Marvel Legends series uh, Shriek from the Spider-Man No Way Home Wave to build an armadillo. So let's go over the packaging first. So first we get the Marvel Legends logo here on top. We get the Marvel Spider-Man logo here, Marvel Shriek. Here is the side art of Shriek. She looks more blue than pale white like she is in this. So that kind of threw me off every time I see the side art here. And then here is the back with the description. If you guys want to pause and read that, Marvel Legends logo here in the corner. Shriek, still blue. And then uh, for the wave, we're building Armadillo, like I said. We already went over the integrated suit. We already did a black and gold suit. Dr. Strange, J. Jonah Jameson, Miles Morales. We still need to do Mordon. And we are doing Shriek now. Here's the other side. Here is the top with that spider logo there. And then here's the bottom with the DCPI. But besides that, let's crack her open. And here is Shriek out of the package here. So let's go over the accessories. So first we get Armadillo's torso, which we'll go over once we build him. And we also get the shoulder piece for him, which we'll also go over once we build him. So let's put that back here. And then next we got two sets of hands, one of them being fisted hands. So this one, they're the same, uh, they're, they're the same uh, sculpts that we've seen before, but this one's just completely white. Whereas the other hand here, her right hand, has a little bit of a black in there. For her longer sleeve which looks like it's like torn up here so that's cool and then here it looks like we got like sword holding hands so yeah I don't know why we have this but yeah she doesn't have a sword so yeah I don't know but completely white with a little bit of black on the other hand and here is streak up close so uh, we get a new head, head sculpt here. You get the nice black hair with some bangs in the front here. You get the bright blue eyes. <laughs> kind of a bit of a bigger a bigger eyes than we've seen before. Uh, you get some black eye eyeliner there. Black eyebrows. You get the uh, like, uh, black kite design there on her eye where she gets the scar. Completely white out eye here. And then you get like this black chin piece here. Black lips. <laughs> You get some earrings in there and then some uh, black uh, around the cheeks. And then you get a lot of cool white design here. I really like the white on this. It's like very like pearly white, whereas a lot of the other figures are kind of just, I don't know what they, how to explain it, but this one's like a pearly white. I like this type of white. Um, and then you get all this like dangling belt here, which is silver, soft plastic. <laughs> Um, and then here's the hands here. So you get some wide open hands that we've seen before. So this one also has a little black there. Here's the completely white out hand. You get some wrist designs here, or wrist accessories here. But it's completely glued on there. It's a silver look. And then you get the completely blacked out legs. You get pinless joints here. And you get double jointed elbows for her. And pinless. So that's awesome. And then you see the white go all the way around your shoulder, the back with some zigzagging here. And then there's the legs again. So yeah, let's go over your articulation first. So I believe she has a disc ball joint head. We'll see here. Nope, double ball joint head. So she cannot look down really or up. She can look left and right a little bit. The hair kind of gets away. Little head pivoting there. Shoulders can move out that far. 360 rotation there, bicep swivel. Double jointed elbows, yes. <laughs> ankles can hinge down that far. Up that ankles. Wrists can hinge down that far and then up this far. 360 rotation around there. She has a ball joint at the at diaphragm joint here. So she can move forward just that far. Backwards that far. Side to side motion. Some twisting. <laughs> Legs can kick out that far. Forward a lot. That's ridiculous. And then backwards just a little bit. Thigh cut. Double jointed knees there not quite a butt kick ankles can down that far up that far nice ankle pivot so yeah that's shriek for you i really like this figure she's awesome it's one of the first female figures that we actually get a double jointed elbows compared whereas she hulk she's a bigger figure so i don't understand why she has a double jointed elbow but this is the first normal sized female figure to get double jointed elbows which is awesome so keep making more of those 
Uh, for the last few, like the Eternals ones, they don't have double jointed, so that upsets me a little bit, but I'm glad that they're starting to do that now, so that's awesome. And then I really like how clean the paint looks on this figure. Uh, I don't see any mess ups with the paint really. I would just say the only problem that I really have is probably the head movement, but I understand why he can't move because of the hair, so yeah. Uh, so I can't really complain about that, but besides that, I really like the design on this figure. The articulation's okay. I mean, pretty good. I would just, it's awesome. The articulation's awesome, just besides that headpiece, like I said. Um, but yeah, and then it comes to, with the Ray Mad accessories. I wish they did, like, an extra head sculpt where she's screaming, because that's her power. So it'd be some, like, like a black bolt effect kind of that would be awesome and have like the sonic waves coming out of her mouth or something like that i don't know um but yeah she's awesome i recommend you get her actually i am surprised in how much i like this figure um but yeah uh that's all i got for this figure if you guys want to check out my link tree it has my tiktok twitch instagram and twitter that's all i got so thanks for watching